Okay. Okay. So seventh road. Okay. So we're now. Yeah. So, but they had they had three three killings of gay men. You yeah. know, because the bars and all the restaurants have the green garbage things. Yeah. And they found one body at one time, and then three weeks later, another body of gay men who got well killed. I think they caught the guy. But talking about trans people, which wasn't as popular back then, I remember her name. She was her name was Kiki, and she like adopted me. She would go to the bars and stuff. They would let her in, but you know they weren't that popular. And she was Spanish, and she said and she didn't speak English well, but she spoke English, and she was like kind of educated. And she said, I know who's doing this. I've seen him. I know. I know who does this. But they don't listen to me because of who I am. Really? And they didn't care about what was going on here anyway at that time. Right. So, but three people got killed. And one time, she, I, to this day, and I remember, I told her years later, when I used to go to the gay pride with my mother here, yeah, and I would introduce her, she saved my life. Because she saw me talking to this guy in the car that I just had a really, really bad feeling about. Like, you know, when you shouldn't do this, but, mm -hmm. you know, you, you maybe I will or maybe I won't. And she ran up and she pulled the knife on him and she said, you leave him alone and don't ever go near him again. Because Ooh. she knew that that was the guy. How that wow. ever proved out or was that him, I don't know. But I knew that I shouldn't have got in that car and I never intended to, kind of. But had she not pulled that, that knife, I might have. Uh, and you know, you should tell these you know, stories about being a male prostitute. That's back in the 70s. That was in the, that was 74, 75. Right, I right. was still in high school. Right. But yeah, and so she, and, and when they found the bodies, they were literally around the corner in the two green things. He dropped them wow. in the same place every time. But I don't know how that played out. I don't know if they ever caught him or if that was the real guy who did it. Yeah. But there was something really suspicious about this guy. Yeah, and so, Kiki, Kiki just disappeared out of your life after she saved you? Well, no, we saw each other still throughout the time, and she said, always watch out, Andrew, she says. And how old was like, she? How, I mean, if she did this go At on? that time, she was probably in her early 20s. So what I'm saying is you saw her over a period of how long? Several years? Or Several just, years. You oh. were 17? Yeah, I was 17 then. I mean, and when I come back to parades and stuff, she was here for I don't know whatever happened to her. God knows. Mm. But yeah, that was she. Yeah, I still remember her to this day. You never know. So this will dedicate this video on YouTube, the memory of Kiki. Yeah. Who saved your life? All right. Huh? <laughs>